As the concept of a dirty bomb has been around for many decades now, although nowhere near as destructive as a conventional nuclear device, they still have the potential to cause a somewhat inconvenient amount of damage and short to mid-term radioactive contamination. So, what exactly is a dirty bomb? Well, a dirty bomb, or radiological dispersal device, is a mixture of conventional explosives combined with a radioactive element such as powdered uranium or even chemicals as might be used for certain medical treatments. Although, as we previously mentioned, setting off such a device will not cause a nuclear explosion, what it will do is release a large amount of radioactive dust over the target zone. Although this radioactive dust is unlikely to remain concentrated enough to cause mass loss of life, it certainly has the potential to cause radiation sickness to anybody in close proximity to the original explosion, as well as increasing susceptibility to certain long-term illnesses such as cancer. Furthermore, decontaminating the area could prove to be logistically challenging, especially if particles were to get into the soil or water supplies. 